In this video, we're going to go over a category of scripts, not really a particular script to use, but a category of scripts that you can apply to your everyday language and your communications with prospects or customers. Okay. Uh, so the, the concept of noun labels is more or less of how to make an action you're trying to encourage in someone, make it a noun label as it'll encourage their behavior more than if that phrase was just a simple verb. Okay. It's probably going to make more sense uh, through these examples. Kind of silly, you know, when you were a little kid, you know, you were probably more likely uh, to respond to your parents in the way that they wanted you to respond if they asked you to, hey, little buddy, like, can you be my helper? Instead of, hey, little buddy, can you please help? You know, I don't really want to help, mom, but if you ask me to be my helper, you know, that perception is more positive than, you know, just helping. I don't want to be your helper, mom, of course. So I'll, I'll pitch in and pick up my toys or whatever it is. Kind of a silly example that everyone can probably relate to. You know, in adulthood, you're more likely to take the action of voting, let's say, if um, with that little voter sticker, right? I want to be a voter. I don't just want to take the, <laughs> effectively do the chore of voting. I want to be a voter, right? That, that has a positive perception. And that's really critical with noun labels is, it's not going to work if the label is something that the recipient does not want to be known as. Okay. I want to be a helper. I want to be a voter. So I'm going to respond relatively well to those phrases. But if it was something negative, you know, I probably won't respond in the, in the fashion that, you know, is intended by the communicator really. And a real world example for us is, you know, thanking customers, right? Thank you for being a supporter of home details is going to be received better uh, than just saying, Hey, thank you for your support. You know, I think the logical or psychological reason that's going behind this is, you know, thank you for being a supporter of home details. Oh, that's ongoing versus thank you for your support. Maybe that's historical or in the past, you know, not necessarily commitment into the future. Um, so that is the concept of noun labels. Try to apply it to your language. Uh, it's a way to encourage the recipient of your communication to take an action, um, you know, or encourage behavior that you want them to take.